I got to thinking the other day about just life and how busy life can be. And sometimes we belong to a large group, a large circle of people. And there's so many things. And if you could ever say yes to everything, you would literally be busy seven days a week. Sometimes we joke and we say we're busy 10 days a week because there's just so much to do. And sometimes that can just feel defeating because we start thinking, you know, okay, I can go to this wedding shower, I can go to this graduation, and then I have a baby shower, and then I have, you know, all of this stuff on top of the obligations you already have with work or with school or with family or with kids or whatever their extracurricular activities are. And before you know it, you are just so weighed down because you have this massive calendar full and there's no room for anything. There's no room to breathe. And I think sometimes we do that because we feel like we have to. We, we feel like we have to be accessible or that if we are available, there's no excuse not to say yes. And so I just want to give you some freedom today and let you know that no is a complete sentence. No is perfectly acceptable. Not everything is for you to go to. Not everything is for you to attend or be part of. And it's okay to bow out. If we stay so busy that we don't have time for anything else, to clean our house, to maintain our home, then that's not living the way God wants us to. We're definitely not making time for Him. I mean, maybe you are, but it may be rushed and it may be frustrating. Having a busy schedule like that and living stressed and overwhelmed is not part of God's plan for you, just so you know that. So again, here's freedom for you. It's okay to say no. It's okay and you should create margin in your schedule, in your calendar, so that you can make time for the things that God has for you to do. Seek him first. Pray and ask him, Lord, what do you want me to do with my day today? You plan my steps. You mark out my calendar. You tell me the tasks that you want me to complete today and the things, the obligations that you want me to say yes to. Ask him first before you commit. And don't feel bad for saying no to other things, invitations or whatnot.